Hello and welcome. I'm Rahul Bose and this is UAE's most definitive inter-school quiz show, the Emax Star Quiz Challenge 2014. For the next nine weeks, I will be the quiz master to some of the smartest young minds in the UAE in my quest to find a champion team who will hoist the ultimate cup of quizzing glory, the Star Quiz Challenge Rolling Trophy. But what makes a champion quizzing team? We believe it's a combination of preparation, perceptiveness, perseverance, pride and passion. Which one of the three teams in front of me will have the perfect mix of all of these will be seen today. Let's start by meeting them. Team A, the Emirates National School Sharjah. Tell us a little bit about yourselves. My name is Danny Rajakumar and I study in class 10 in the Emirates National School Sharjah. My interests are cricket and I love to study science, especially bio, and then also I have a small interest in math, max and social. Wonderful. Please. My name is Justin Joy of class 10. My interests are playing football, uh, chess, that's And also quizzing. Yeah. Team B is GEMS Modern Academy, Dubai. Please introduce yourselves. Uh, hi, I'm Ashwin Naran, uh, GEMS Modern Academy, grade 9. Uh, I love playing cricket, uh, football, uh, debating, quizzing, uh, anything that involves, you know, uh, talking. <laughs> Good for you. Please. Uh, my name is Satwek Das and I study in grade 8. I love to play the guitar and I also like to play basketball and I'm really good in athletics. And finally, Team C, our own English High School Abu Dhabi. My name is Ashit Fahad. I'm in grade 8, our own English High School Abu Dhabi. My main interests are in science and movies. Hi, my name is Vishnu Vardhan, grade 9, our own English High School Abu Dhabi. My biggest interests are in cars and Formula 1. Sometimes all contests start with a trial by fire. It will be no different here in our first round. Rapid Fire brought to you by UAE Exchange. Six direct questions per team. In case you aren't sure about the answer, say pass and we will come back to the question if time permits. Five points for a correct answer, no negative points, and you have 45 seconds to answer all questions. Team A, Emirates National School, Sharjah. Your time starts now. In November 2013, the city of Takluban was ravaged by Typhoon Haiyan. Which Asian country is the city in? Philippines. That's correct. Which organization was awarded the 2013 Nobel Peace Prize? OPCW. That's correct. The name of this communication device literally means distant voice. Name this device. Pass. Pass. What is the name of the parrot in Robert Louis Stevenson's novel, Treasure Island? Pass. In which city is UAE's only UNESCO World Heritage Site located? Dubai. Incorrect. And finally, which Formula One motor racing legend was born in the German town of Hurth Hermulheim? Michael Schumacher. That's correct. Well, your time's up. James Modern Academy, Dubai, your time starts now. In February 2013, what exploded over the Russian city of Chelyabinsk, injuring people and damaging several buildings? Uh, it was a meteor. Like. That's correct. Which novelist won the 2013 Nobel Prize for Literature? A pass. Which human body part consists of bones named true, false and floating? Uh, the ribs. That's correct. In which Asian country was the first ever World Cup cricket match played outside England? Uh, pass. In 2007, the sanctuary for which endangered species in Oman was removed from the list of UNESCO World Heritage Sites? Uh, was it Oryx? That's correct. And finally, in which country did the cappuccino coffee originate? Brazil. Incorrect. Our own English high school Abu Dhabi, your time starts now. In July 2013, which country became the 28th member of the European Union? Uh, pass. Which Scottish physicist who has a fundamental particle named after him was a co-winner of the 2013 Nobel Prize for Physics? Peter Higgs. Correct. Which Olympic sport is named after an estate in Gloucestershire, Great Britain? Pass. Pass. The trunk of an elephant is formed by the fusion of two facial parts, the upper lip and which other part? Nose. That's correct. In the nursery rhyme, Lucy Lockett lost her pocket. Who found the pocket? Pass. Pass. The location for the ancient city of Taxila is a UNESCO World Heritage Site in which Asian country? India. Incorrect. We'll go back to which Olympic sport is named after an estate in Gloucestershire, Great Britain? Pass. Time. Time's up. 
In numerology, it is said that the number six occupies a unique position of mental power, which when used positively is constructive. At the Emacs Star Quiz Challenge 2014, I'm going to give you the opportunity to use your mental powers very constructively by offering you six categories to choose from in our next round. Categories brought to you by Skyline University. We will start with the lowest scoring team. Each team gets to choose only one category. 10 points for a correct answer. If the team does not know the answer, then the question passes to the next team for 10 points. 10 seconds to answer a direct question. 5 seconds to answer a past question. Team C, your six categories are culture, events of the 20th century, computers slash IT, potluck, football, and Australia. Quickly, culture, 20th century events, computers, IT, potluck, football, Australia. Computers and IT. Right. Your question is, according to Moore's law, the number of which device would double on a computer chip every two years? Can I have the question repeated? According to Moore's law, the number of which device would double on a computer chip every two years? The time's up. It passes to team A. Calculator. Calculator. Incorrect. Team B. CPU. Well, none of you got the answer right. The correct answer is transistors. Team A, it's your turn. You have five categories to choose from. Football. Football it is. Your question. Which football club did Zlatan Ibrahimovic represent in the 2013-14 season of the French League? PSG. PSG is correct. I'll give it to you. It's actually Paris Saint-Germain, but you're absolutely right. Gems Modern Academy Dubai, you have four categories left. We'll take potluck. Potluck it is. The number of permanent members of the UN Security Council is the same as the number of digits of a United States zip code. What is the number? Six. Incorrect. That passes on to our own English high school, Abu Dhabi. Five. Five. Correct. Before we head to our first break of this episode, we're going to tell you the scores. Gems Modern Academy, Dubai, at 15 points. In second place, our own English high school, Abu Dhabi, with 20 points. And leading the pack after two rounds is the Emirates National School, Sharjah, with 25 points. But, as you've heard the saying, it's early days yet. Are we going to go to the next round? It's time for a break, but before I do, let me put out the weekly viewer question. Let's play the viewer's challenge. In which Hollywood film did Morgan Freeman play South African President Nelson Mandela? Your options are A. Cry Freedom B. Invictus C. Mandela D. Malcolm X To send in your entries, log on to www.starselect.com slash starquiz and like I said, you could get a fantastic premium gift hamper from Star. You think about the answer as we take a short break. Stay with us on Star Plus, the pulse of South Asians in the Middle East. <laughs> 